回の続き。ねえねえ、ほら。What's going on, YouTube? My name is Mario Mendes, and welcome back to some King Koi Golden Lovers. I'm Echi. This is episode 27. If you've not seen episode 26, go ahead and watch it. It was a banger of an episode. Oro and Reyna had a nice little moment. Bro was basically bawling like a little baby boy, and Reyna was like, There, there, doing the mommy rule, just so you know. So now I understand why they call her mommy and why she has such a mommy energy, apparently. Anyways. <laughs> If you happen to enjoy this video, please consider hitting that like and subscribing if you have not done so. Thank you. It really does help my self esteem. Anyways, let's get straight into this video. No time to waste. <clears throat> yeah? Reyna to one of the beds of the night, was it really? Welcomed? <laughs> Where did you hear that? I have a good ごまかそうとしても無駄よ。したんでしょう。レーナと。but we didn't. Maybe we did. The different mindsets between a normal male student and a princess diverged as broadly as holy and dark elements. I haven't said anything. Why grab my arm? I wasn't even part of that conversation, and I wouldn't have agreed to it even if I had been. Why are you trying to wring my arm off? Come again. I haven't said anything. Why are you pulling out your blade? I escaped from Ellison. Let's save the sleepover for some other time, Zoe. You too, Reyna. Stop instigating. Uh, just to hang out? That much should be fine, just like when we had Sukiyaki a while back. I didn't make. I didn't mind making my place available. As long as that sounds okay with it. e l i s a n shrugged her shoulders in exasperation at Sylvie's cheers. Nice. On that note, I headed home with a huge crowd again today. Fine by me. Stew again? If it comes with that high grade meat, Then I could eat it forever. Oi, oi, bimbo ninkayo. Yup. So this time, I dash him so this time. Demo sonza, mosiroko nayo. Take to any bravo, s t i c k m a y o With that, the four of us headed into town. Yaki no hokani ninki gar nabe to yeba. Kimuchi, mozu, shabu shabu. All questionable picks. Shabu shabu was tough to prepare, and kimchi. And awful, offa. Not awful. Stews were majorly acquired taste. We could go with something more agreeable. I'd say so, but is Oden something you do on your own? A little different. If you do, the broth dribbles down and gets all sticky, and the daikon in the middle breaks apart easily, which makes it pretty tough to eat. Basically, only Chib Star does it. It's pretty sad when he doesn't, huh? Reyna rushed into a nearby convenience store. Hey, Omachi! 
She bought a bunch of stuff. How is she so fast? Now, now. Look, there's a bench over there. It would be improper to eat standing up, but it should be just barely passable if we were seated. By my criteria, anyway. There was no stopping Sylvie once she worked up an appetite either way. You wouldn't know those two unless you're familiar with Odin. Anyhow, give them a taste. She bought them two sets of chopsticks too, so they tried to bite. The broth is the bulk of the favor. Flavor, excuse me. Uh, you brought that? This is tasty too, so help yourselves. Drop it in the edge, at the edge, and encourage them to put it on with their chopsticks. They each brought a bite to their mouth at once. It's a sure bet in the Tokai region. I think they put yuzu pepper and whatnot on it in Kyushu. Odin covered a wide range, so most seasonings went well with it. Incidentally, the most mainstream condiment to put on Odin. Was, of course, mustard. Was it just my imagination, or was mustard actually one of the best examples of a condiment you either loved or hated? I think mustard's good. Mustard is pretty good. Yeah, they're bag worthy on a global level in terms of handiness. As long as you ignored how explo exploitative the enterprise system could be. <laughs> Looks like she's going to focus on convenience store food rather than Odin tonight, huh? Meat buns, pizza buns, fried chicken, yakitori, naotas. After gobbling up the assortment of warm foods one could buy at a convenience store, we were all stuffed. That sounds nice. We called that enough for dinner and decided to head back. You're still eating. With the one person among us with a bizarre stomach capacity, Sylvie, in tow. Ah, uh, yes. We made it back to my place. Ah. Sounded like it was chilly even to the ones who were born in Northern Europe. So, it's great and we all got together, but to do what? I know, why are you yelling at me? For some reason, Reyna tugged them both by the hand out of the room. Hmm? Maybe they were headed to Reyna's room? I guess that was fine, but why did they bother coming to my room first? Didn't make much sense. While I wondered that and sat waiting, the phone rang. Hello? What in the world are you going on about? I heard her taking a deep breath. A breath. My ears instantly started to ring. Super 
She's on one. They were apparently outside my bedroom when the door swung open. Hey, what's all the shouting for? Oh, yeah. Nice, biddies. Wow. What the heck is Ella wearing, though? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Wonderful. Absolutely nothing. You are fantastic. Was this why you wanted them to come over? She was putting some serious effort into studying design, but when it came time to play, she played hard. She must have loved anything and everything when it came to fashion, and I loved that about her. あ、ああ、Oh. <laughs> of course, with that assortment of events, it had been a few days since I'd cried my eyes out in front of Reina. I'd completely gone back into the swing of my former Fun Noble Academy lifestyle. And honestly, I felt it was thanks to Reina. Of course, Reina. She was like, cheer up, buddy. Boobs. That's one way of doing things. Yeah. Why would there be? Nah, I'm fine. Hmm. Today had started off like any other day. But something had changed. What had changed? <gasps> oh, excuse me. My timer went off. And not for the video end, but to upload episode if this is episode 27 to upload 26 yeah anyways be right back Alrighty, i am back that right but i can't stop uh, <laughs> what the if the happiness that escaped me makes you smile that's what counts my day was as peaceful as could be <sighs> <sighs> Isn't this Raina's root? What are you doing? Ha ha ha. I'm sorry. Suri and Ellison were the usual sauce. シルビア王女の同じに息を吹きかけて遊べる男って世界でも彼だけでしょうね。The boys were the same as ever, too. Yaka, shut up. まあまあ、Yaka。最近のこの教室、品性が下がっているわ。Perhaps Jogasaki was a little irritated. Can't deny it. Reina also never changed. And yet, did things look differently only when Reina was in front of me? Oh wait, that's not a question. Let me try that again. <clears throat> and yet, did things look different only when Reina was in front of me? Because my eyes saw her in a new light? Ugh. <sighs> Sides just kept on coming. <laughs> Sorry. Another peaceful day blew by in the blink of an eye. And then... Pitter-patter. Pitter-patter. 
It's not out yet. Verena stretched out on my bed with a ramen in one hand. She had a massive pile of my manga by her side. Oh boy. The line between the situation being a good or troublesome thing was quite subtle. Verena had been spending a lot of time in my room lately. Probably started with her checking in on me, but she'd gotten hooked on my manga collection in the process. You don't read much shonen manga, do you? Ah, yeah, everything goes all in on either sex appeal or shock value. Readers these days were accustomed to thrills. They drop a series like a rock if one didn't deliver exactly that. Go and Gori is the easiest tool a series can use. She was more cowardly than I thought. Which is why you come to my place to read every single one, huh? Not really. Left me at a loss, but she wasn't a bother. So then, what sort of manga do you normally read? That seems to be the in thing nowadays, huh? I got the feeling it was the most mass-produced manga format in Japan right now. A single book can span an entire season of anime, too. Oh, do you watch anime? Huh. Basically, all of the four panels slash the life manga these days were produced under the assumption they'd get anime adaptations, so many of them came out recently. So, what about girls' manga? Ah, I think I get what you mean. Rena was lazing around as we talked. If she felt at home here, that was most important, but she was lounging around on my bed in a skirt, which meant her panties were probably in view. Then again, Reina had tons of openings like these for ages now. Hmm, uh, yeah. The way I was now, my mindset was different from before. In this situation, I'd kind of like to avoid staring at Reina when her panties were most likely visible. I was trying to look at her strangely. Although she did seem to think I was strange either way. Hmm. Sure. For what it was worth, she didn't overstay her welcome and headed back before 8 o'clock at night. I could tell my racing heartbeat had settled down. Man, what the heck was I doing? If I liked her, I should just tell her so already. We were already on friendly terms, but it left me somewhat hesitant to take another step forward. How should I approach this? Then... <clears throat> oh no, Christmas is coming up. That means it's gonna end soon. No! I could only assume. I'm sad. I don't want this route to end. <sighs> Sigh. I hope she's in golden time though. Because I'm definitely playing King Kong golden time if she's still in there. <laughs> The girls just so happen to be chatting. Yeah? They called out to me. While there were most more girls like Akana Chan I could talk to, it was rare for these girls in class. From these girls in class. I think it's normal. In fact, I think girls who seriously believe false tastes like takes like I don't want to spend Christmas alone are idiots. You took that literally? And you're single? はい、はい、茶子さんないの。いつまつくん。寝口には言うようになりましたよね。ええ、何何いつまつく私のこと好きとか。ははは、no. It was true that I'd managed to talk to other girls from class in the same way I did Reina or Sylvie, but... So she says, that's correct, female student, see? 
そうだい島くんのことあたしらに紹介してくれないかい That's what this was about? Is that what this is all about? You want me to introduce you to him at a mixer or something? Oh, it's a good thing, Goku. So, I'm going to get a master. I'm going to get a master. It's not like I couldn't. He's incredibly tone deaf, but he loves karaoke. I'm sure he turned up if I asked him to go. I'm going to get a master. I'm going to get a master. He's got a girlfriend, though. I hadn't seen them in a while, and I'm not totally in the loop, but I hadn't heard anything about them breaking up. No, she's from another club. Um, here. I had a picture and showed them my phone. Chiaka, a year younger and currently a first year. That's a good way to describe her. She was plain enough that transcendent beauties like Sylvia or Ellison would blow her away, but was too cute for any man to ever consider letting go. Knowing Torio, he might. He doesn't realize how popular he is. She must have realized she had zero chances of coming out on top. Kaga was ticked. Ticked? I was gonna say tickled, but. Is that all you needed? I'm going back to my room. A different one. Like Kikuchio? Saigo or Yamamoto, then? Mommies. <laughs> the way y'all rate men is horrible. Yup, well, we rambled on and on. Yup, yup. <laughs> Of course, an exasperated Jogosaki came rushing down from the second floor. Ayaka, What's up your butt now, Ayaka? Hmm, <laughs> interesting. Who? Who was that again? Riding on his family's coattails to get the company to push him, huh? You pretty much have to be a star for that. So, why did someone like that call for you? Jogosaki declared proudly before her departure. I checked what that Narusawa would ever look like on my phone. Huh, he's a handsome dude. She looked frustrated that the others in class were blessed with men. Oh well, better just leave Kagabi. I bet she'd be unpopular for the rest of her life unless she did something about that pitiful impression she gave off. More importantly, guess Jogasaki really is popular. Hmm. Ah, that would automatically mean no Ellison either. Jogosaki certainly might stand above all the others. Her face was her one great feature, as was that tight body. What the freak does that even mean? <laughs> the thing was, though, 
Yeah. Mommy Reyna. What about Reyna? Huh? Uh, nah, never mind. Close one. What was I frustrated about? I'd confirmed that Reyna was popular before anyway. But Reyna. She was at least on the same level as Jogosaki and stood out among the rest in our class. Oh, she sure did. She sure did. どうも。お待たせしましたわ。はい、どうも。ちょっと遅いよ。寒いのに待たされちゃったじゃん。ナルサは待たされるの嫌いだから。はい、クショ。クショ。ま、待たされるのがお嫌いなのにお待たせして申
そういった話は聞きませんがじゃあまだなんだねえエル素敵だと思わないあの二人が結婚なんてことになったらシルビー様にとって日本でのご友人で最も近しいお二方ですからねうーん決めたわエル私あの二人のことを応援するあの二人がカップルになるよう働きかけてみるわはいリアチャーとウォウタケンバーバディングイン She may have been the Sylvia somehow of sordid lead royalty, but she could still apparently be just as obnoxious as any other woman her age. She'd support us, though. I felt like such a sleaze for feeling hopeful. As things stood, I had no idea how I should get closer to Reyna. If I could have some minor external force upset the balance and see how Reyna reacts, I might be on board with that. Was it okay to get my hopes up? Perhaps I could ask Sylvia to interfere a little more in order to make some waves. There you go, Oro. There's the wave. Oh, that's going to be great. Yeah, we, we realized that. We realized. We realized. Pure doesn't cut it. You call this sloppy. <laughs> Reyna seemed to pass her comment off as a joke and cackled loudly. For real? Dang. Ugh. That is too bad. Okay, stop. I covered her mouth. Lucky for me, Reyna still looked oblivious to what was going on. I took Sylvia away with me. <laughs> it's her fault for committing an act of large scale terrorism. I'm glad we're in agreement, Ella. <laughs> Don't give me that. Yeesh. Personally speaking, I hadn't sorted out about my own feelings for Reyna yet. Our onlookers had gotten some big mouths on them. Ugh, this was unbelievably annoying. I could only hope that nothing worse than this happened. Uh huh. Oh boy. Jogasaki's usual, but fake as heck, smile returned to her face in no time. But the second she dropped her guard, her genuinely malicious expression reared its head again. Something must have really ticked her off. Oh boy, it'd probably be best if I kept away from her for a while. Whoa, scared me. What's up? Oh my god. Uh huh. You're still going there? Oh my god. Christ. Oh, finally fulfilled his long cherished desire? Ah, yeah, I guess that would happen. Then what? Large group of elementary school boys came in? でも、かけ回る男の子たちを見てて、みんな裸だなって思ったら、体に異変が。はあ。はあ。俺の一部が。おい、ダメね。おい、ダメね。What? You got hard? Oh my god. What? 
You. You're hopeless. 2D crosses are women with peepees, but 3D boys are still men, you know? Alright, bro, is super gay. <laughs> Calm down, it's not too late. As long as you haven't lost all interest in women, you can back you can come back from this. I don't know, man. I don't know about that. But it's okay. Let him be gay. Nah. Yeah, for sure. Take a good look. There are plenty of cute girls in class. I pointed to our female classmates. But I didn't want to use Rain or Silver to spark this guy's desire. She would probably work. Look over there. These are womanly pheromones. Look at her and come back to your senses. Channel that inner manliness and let this ample bosomed woman with a tight body excite you to no end. Good, good. You know that door you opened yesterday? Just go ahead and close it. Yup. Good. Yeah, let's take our time and get him activated. Oh, we'll do, buddy. What'd you do yesterday, Ayaka? Jesus Christ. I don't I don't understand. I don't know if it'll get even more vulgar than this. This has been quite crazy. <laughs> don't even blame it on the Odo, like it's not his fault. They're weird. Actually it might be his fault. Uh oh. Boy oh boy. Hey. No. Gotcha. She'd finished reading a volume yesterday and wouldn't be coming to buy the visit today. I was a little disappointed, but part of me felt relieved. Now that I had nothing else to do today, maybe I could go visit Ryo. What's up? Huh? The princess seemed hell bent on meddling in my and Raina's relationship. But maybe I should put my foot down? Either way, I decided to tag along with Sylvie for the rest of the day. Okay. Alright. Ah, yes, I remember the spot. Do you guys remember the spot? Me too. Yeah, good times. For sure. You're not cold? A simple chat after school turned into a rather elegant affair when it was with a princess. Oh. I wasn't about to turn down a tea party either. May as well join her. Okay. This is low quality? Right, right. You served the tea perfectly. We both calmly tipped back our teacups. These weird ideal conditions to have a calm conversation. I just realized something. Isn't this like the first time LA tags in one of those tea parties? Ain't that nice? <clears throat> I spat my tea out, but Ella san instantly blocked it by draping a napkin between us to prevent Sylvie from getting dirty. だって、Anyway, if I were to ask someone to give a speech at a wedding, I think I'd ask Ellison. Before this conversation goes any further, I want to be clear that I have absolutely zero plans to get married anytime soon. 
couldn't you tell Reyna and I didn't have that sort of relationship this morning? How did you make so many leaps of logic in the span of eight hours? Well, thank you. Zoe was eccentric as ever and I couldn't get a good read on her. Which may be why it was nice we got to talk like this. She's so wholesome. She's great. Um, let me see. I guess now was a good time as I need to get my feelings in order. How to correct this discrepancy between myself and Sylvie. Reyna has certainly been on my mind lately. I'm not sure if it's a crush or something else entirely. I don't know in what way I like her. Either way, this had all started. Ah, yes. Yeah, that had to be it. Of course. It was true that I was interested in Reyna. I thought she was cute and I knew I liked her. That trendy look of hers was adorable. Just as her jovial appearance suggested, she was really easy to get along with. But if you asked me if I were in love with either of those things, then no. If there was anything I did love, it was probably how kind she was. Maybe I fell for her because she pampered me, even I had to admit it was somewhat miserable, but it was true that my feelings had changed that day. If anything, I still perceived every part of her as a friend, save for her kind side. A good friend. A very good friend. Nothing more and nothing less. Which is why the idea of professing my love doesn't feel right. Not yet, for whatever reason. Sylvie's shoulders drooped with disappointment. Yeah, I'd really appreciate it if you stopped. Yeah? Hmm? Wait, what do you mean by the first love thing? I don't understand that. Yeah. Thanks for the tea. What just happened? <laughs> I swear to God, if this route ends short or they don't get together, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not ending the video, I'm ending the channel. <笑>集中力って意味じゃデザイナーの才能あるかも。くくらい校舎ってちょっと怖い。あ。ああ。リアちゃんかびっくりした。びっくりはこっちだわ。いきなりでけえ声出すな。さあせん。帰るの what a scaredy cat. <laughs> there's hardly ever times where there's a scene without Oro. And that feels weird. Because I, like in San Rimbanka and Cafe Stella, there was a lot of another views which didn't have the protagonist around and two characters were conversating without the protagonist. We need more of these in this visual novel. なな。うっとうしく思われてないかな。ドキドキ。おい、行かねえのか。え、あ、うん。てめえが怖いからってついてきてんだろうが、ちゃんと来いよ。はい。さあ、面倒くせえな。ほら、ハグ出るぞ。うん。あれ？こっちは悪いけどなんか優しい。ちぇ。住んでるビショネンでも相手してるみたいな。別の意味でドキドキ。そういやお前、あいつとどうなの？あいつ？オロ？ああ。
どうって。いい友達だよ。男友達じゃ一番かな。そっちもでしょ面白いよね、オーロ。意外と気配り上手だし。Surprisingly. まあ、男はあいつ以外いねえけど。ん脈はなしか。一かわいそうに。Oh no, it's not looking good. I don't like this. I don't like this. ちなみにだな。あいつはなかなかいいやつだぞ。Where's the homie? え、うん、知ってる。今そうこっちが言ったじゃん。応援ってどうすればいいんだ ?Good question. シルビーでシミュレートしてみよう。あいつが人の恋愛に踏み込んで応援しようとしたら。はねえねえねえな、クリスマスをオーロと一緒に過ごすのはどうかしら。二人は結婚するといいと思うわ。好きでスピーチしたいの。さすがにそんなバカじゃねえよな。すまんシルビー。<笑>そういや朝シルビーにも言われたな。オーロはどうだって。は？シルビー、知ってるかなほら、うちのクラスにいるソルティーレージュのお姫様。ああ、ああ、噂は聞いてる。あたしとオールをくっつけようとしてるのかも。詳しくはわからないんだけど。でもな、そもそもあたし、恋愛とかそういうのがまずピンとこないんだよね。うん。それよりは、友達のままでバカやっていたいっていうか、肩こりそうな関係は微妙っていうか。うん。Interesting. なるほどね。わかる半分。俺も仲いいやつがいたとして、そいつとの関係を崩すのは怖い。That is scary. だよね、だよね。でも、もう半分はわかんねえかな。え、hmm? 恋をするチャンスがあるなら、そこに突っ込むのもいいと思う。チャンスがあるってことは、それだけで恵まれてると思う。Left her speechless. Nice. No, t h e m o e get up. Ah, Mate, Mate. Hi. Hi, get her out of here. The kind of Kurumaga couldn't miss me. Look at him, Master. Are you talking about this? Eh, this is a Nelson. He know me, I know. Second, I'll be sure. I. こちらまだ学生ですのでお願いしますねはいあやか誰と電話またなるさは今日や今日も会うんだってへえマストで羨ましい本人は迷惑してらっしゃるようですけどはいわかりましたあはいはあほんと気持ち悪い Why do you keep going out with him? I don't get it. I don't get it. What's up with him? Tocha! Yatto a carry to Coroni Sketa. Yarigato Riacha, who could the Morachate? No, demoe. Jana. Ah, not the mate. Conomamo Shabby Sioyo. He could. Eja. Ah, you have more take you. Nani got a tie? そこのコンビニでメロンパンチョコチップが入ってるやつはダメだぞ普通のなはいはーい<笑> See, something is always up her butt. あ、あやか外にお迎えの車が来てるよ分かってるわよオーロとレーナどうなるのかしらね Sam, I'm, I'm starting to get worried. I'm starting to get a little worried. So, Danjo no Kibini wa Kuashko a r i m a s e Of course, you wouldn't know. Ah, Tarit Tonyo Nio no no no. Ma, Shilby Samaga, said the Rasher Ingai, Monday by Nino de Vanai de Shoka. Oh, Anof Tari, Onia Nano, Tashka des, Asera Nakutomo, Izre, Do you got on in Arkina Shimas? Kakshon Garu Vaka de Varimasenga. Hontoni? はい、今は友人として理想的すぎて麻痺しているのでしょうが。Didn't you just say you don't know anything about the intricacies between men and women? Where's this coming from? いずれそのような形で収まると思いますよ。Yes. そう、妙な事件でもなければ。Curious incidents? あら
城ヶ崎殿あのですからこういうところにはちょっとちょっと昨日も言ったでしょ鳴沢は口答えは嫌いだってですがそのこちら学生ですのでお酒を飲むところはああ大丈夫ここのクラブのメインはお酒じゃないんでアロマバーってところかなまあアルコールの数倍トリックできるとこなんだけどはああ大丈夫よ非合法なのじゃないから Are you sure? まだ合法なアロマを仕入れてるところだからあの本当に付き合いませんというかその僭越ながら鳴沢さんにはうちの曲も大変期待して広告応援させていただいておりますのでこういうバーに通うのはあれまた口答え<笑>くとにかくおいでよ後悔させないから話してはーいお一人様ご案内スマックいった嫌がる不女子を無理やりというのは感心しませんね。Yeah. な、なになに、誰を一体。じゃあ。揉め事にはしたくないか。ね。あ、ふん。おお、ミスターナルサオ。あなたミスターナルサオですね。はい。だ、誰この外人さん。失礼いたします、鳴沢様。こちらハリウッドのホテル王の娘ああ、ジェニー・スミスお嬢様にございます。実はお嬢様は、今日本で新進の俳優、鳴沢京也様に大変ご興味がおありでして。えハリウッドマジはい、セクシーだーセクシーだーよろしければこの後。お付き合い願いないでしょうかハリウッドでのお仕事の話などいろいろもちろんはあ,あ,あ<笑>すまないね城ヶ崎さん実は今日は戦略があったことを思い出して、はあ、そうだこれ手土産にあげるよそこのバーご推薦のお香とっても好きになると思うよもっとたくさん欲しくなったらいつでも連絡して I'm so、confused. じゃあ今日はこれで<笑><笑>ハリウッドだわお、wow! セクシーセクシーでは私たちはこれにて What is X not on bro? Who gave her crack? ご苦労キスなって有能だけど演技力はいまいちね。I don't know about desired. 言ってやらないでください。本人今頃は顔真っ赤だと思います。一応お礼は言うべきでしょうか。いらないわ。早かに怪我がなくてよかった。<笑>もしもし、鳴沢京也だけどドラマ枠から外して。近いうちシャドウとしてニュースで使うことになるから<笑>父親と祖父から美談系のインタビュー映像を撮ってきて、ね、転んでもただでは起きないなそれでんそのアロマスティックどうしますジャパニーズこういうね知ってるわ預かりましょうか触らないで彼の指紋が消えてしまったら価値が半減するわただでは起きないどころか転んだところで目につく限りを拾うタイプかどうしてお香に指紋が必要なのかしらあとどうしてエルもアヤカも怖い顔してるのかしら<笑>じゃあね今日は助かりましたええまた学校でねおかえりなさーいご飯にする<咳>お風呂にするいやいや、ベア。そう。で、と、もう、ご飯にしろ。OK。Trying to grow on my delinquent neighbor were in my room upon my return. What are you doing? <笑>今日、リアちゃんとご飯食べることになってね。やたらと俺の部屋に入ろうとするから、うっとうしいから追い出した
でも私の部屋じゃご飯食べれないのよ汚いからね間を取ってここで食べることにした Well, you did physically meet in the middle between your and Raina's rooms. Even if it was an extreme nuisance. Oh, Kora, Nai, Oh, Kora, Nai. You have a yoy stag get on the carasa. Kyo no, you have a Raina toxay melon panto. Ria chan toxay corn beef in the mass. There were three loaves of melon bread and three cans of corned beef on the table. That's way too much of junk food. The flavors couldn't possibly go together, and there's way too few elements for you to call any of it specially made. And finally, I'm not all that hungry. I had just gotten back from a tea party with Sobi. I snacked away on sweets and my belly was pleasantly full. Oh boy. On that note, the three of us ate together. I had room for a single piece of melon bread, and while I was eating. On it. Raina made herself at home in her usual way. Nope. You're not wrong, Ria. And unfortunately, I have to interrupt it because timer is up. This episode actually might be a little shorter. The reason I say that is because I got up to fix my camera, setting up everything, and I had started recording before I was even ready. And then I got up again to turn on the fan, and then I got up again to get uh, episode 26 up. I started uploading it right now as we speak because it takes about three hours to upload on YouTube. Yeah, so. I don't know how long it's going to turn out, but who cares? It's still a decent amount of time, I'd say. But I'm going to wrap it up here. This episode, hmm. <clears throat> it's like what I would normally say in a lot. Nothing crazy, but I'm not going to lie. What they talked about, how they're both kind of like unsure of their feelings toward each other. I kind of hoping that it's what Ella is saying, how they're just scared of like ruining their good relationship that they have at the moment. And that there's a good end to this route because as we all know, I love Reyna and it'd be sucky to have some weird bad ending or something. You know what I mean? But other than that, I wasn't a big fan of the fact that it wasn't that much Reyna around. But the way I look at it also, it's like, it's good to have a little bit of a break on it. Because in the previous episodes, she's been involved heavily. And so, I guess it's a bit of a balance. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But that's all I got to say about this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed episode 27 of King Coin. If you did, please let me know by hitting that like. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Share this video. Share this channel. Let's get hit a thousand subscribers, please. Let's make it happen. And if you made it this far, who is the best girl and why? Oh, and if it's not Raina, your opinion is wrong. Anyways, I am out of here. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Anyways, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. You'll stay safe. And until next time.